Technique number seven is called breaking the claw. When we refer to uh, claw in this case, we're basically referring to like a tagger claw, um, which in Kung Fu is used for many things. In this case, we're using it for a grab. So this is going to be a defense against a hair grab. I'll have Mr. Poignier join me. Okay. Uh, attack comes in nice and slow here. It's a basic hair grab on top of the head. Now, generally, when somebody grabs you in this fashion, what they're getting ready to do is get a grip here so they can hit you with this other hand, okay, which is the free hand. Okay, so you don't want to fool around too long about responding to this. A, you could get popped. B, you're going to lose a lot of hair here if he decides he wants to yank that. So what you're going to do is just reach up here with the left hand, pin this on top of your head. From here, I'm going to off-angle just slightly, but I'm stepping into the attacker here as I bring the elbow down, descending forearm strike onto the back of the elbow here. From here, gaining a little momentum here. Notice the control here as well on the hand. You have a lock here, basically. From here, coming straight in below the ear. Now, as I continue this motion, I'm just turning, torquing, and following through with a palm heel strike to the jaw. That's the finish. Work that again slowly. Okay. One, pin. Two, step in. Descending forearm strike. Three, form a weapon. Control the wrist here. Base of the ear, twerking, turning into the jaw with the left palm heel strike. Okay, one more time from this angle without the count. And we'll show reverse angle. One. Now as I turn and drop this, I'm going to also drop my body weight. Notice that. Two. Have the lock. Form the weapon. Three. As you throw that elbow, you can actually pull a little bit here and actually pull the person into you for extra power. Twerking, turning, palm heel strike. Coming right into the base jawline area. Okay, again, this angle. One, two, three. And again, slowly. One, two, three. And one time, just about half speed. Okay. Demonstrate that now slowly and into the air. One, pin the hand. Two, stepping out here just off angling slightly. As I bring the strike down, I'm also sinking my weight into this horse stance. That's going to break the hold. Here, driving the arm down. It has to go with this. Put, once you put the pressure on the back of your elbow, you'll see why. Here, weapon strike. Leaning into that, pulling the free hand at the same time, following through with the palm heel strike. <coughs> that is technique number seven, breaking the claw.